This video brought to you by Gamefly. Go to GameflyOffer.com slash HaloCanon for a 30-day free trial. Stick around to the end for more details. Hey there, Canonites. Welcome back to Halo Cannon. This is our third goddamn attempt at this. Yes, we can uh, do we it. We got so goddamn close last time, but it froze at the last six minutes. But here's hope. So today I am joined by CIA391. Uh, he is very active in a lot of Halo communities. Uh, great lore master. Very knowledgeable, especially for some of the very obscure stuff, such as that little newspaper at the very opening. Uh, if you go back and watch... Uh, like the the first cut after they show the spirit of fire, you'll see a newspaper which has the very Spock famous the Spock the cat. Yes, <laughs> you can tell um, we've been to, we've you can tell we've done this three times already. Yeah, so we have to feign surprise when certain <laughs> things come up. <laughs> um, but CIA, he's probably best known, at least to me, uh, is a very is a major contributor over at Halopedia. Uh, he's very active on the Halo on uh, the Halo archive. And he is one of the few remaining Masters of Unicorns over on Halo Waypoint, a sort of hey. glitch rank that uh, popped up when during an early uh, transfer between certain systems. Yeah, somewhere around there. I think probably closer to 2011 because I'm sure it was around by the time of CEA. It's on Halopedia somewhere. I made sure it was up somewhere. Yeah. And, on uh, the unicorns page, guys. Yep. We dismissed it briefly, but there was the, the uh, Easter egg, the Pillar of Autumn, which yep. many fans, myself included, were very happy to see. Um, it also it also is important in the story a little bit also. Yeah. The rhinos for some strange reason. Yeah, because reasons. Yeah. And here is Fire Team Egg. Or, yeah, what, we, what we're presuming is uh, Omega. Spartan Group Omega. Yep. So you got six Spartans in total there. I got to be sure to count uh, count them up when they appear in uh, the Arcadia outskirts. But yeah, yep. It's definitely more Spartans on what appear here. Yep. Uh, they're yellow. <laughs> That's red team. Yep. Red team. We're gonna be yellow today <laughs> because of reasons. Yeah. It's one of the unfortunate consequences of the way the game is uh, programmed. So they have to differentiate the units that aren't yours, but, you know, they have the pre-programmed colors from the multiplayer. Yep. All right. First things first, let's make sure that our spot is clear. Yes. <laughs> and let's get that black box. Right. Oh yeah, by the way, we're ignoring all the civilians. Screw them. Black box should be right up here. Yep. As usual. There's the black box for the timeline. I, I know I've talked about it in some previous episodes, but God, I love the Halo Wars timeline so much. It's one of those things I still gotta get, like, just raw footage for. <laughs> for my, uh... For, for reasons. Yeah. I, I totally want one in Halo Wars 2. Oh, I really hope they do. And honestly, the Halo in general, they need to just have a codex uh, for the main, for the games, even if it's done through an updated version of the Halo channel or something, but hopefully much smaller. Yeah. Um, different uh, side, and not for something completely different. This is something we just discovered on a previous playthrough, and I'm kind of noticing another detail now. All the Sword Elites in this level and probably in the game in general, are honor guards. I don't know if that's meant to, if there's like a canon reason for that, or if that's just a, if that's just a game resource thing, but it's a cool little detail. It, it certainly doesn't break canon in any way. No. It's just more interesting, really. Yeah. Oh yeah, and we're ignoring the guy over here. We're just destroying the guys in the towers just so that they're clear. Yep. Local units. All units. On my way. Oh, one of my units died. Oh, that's just, that's sad. <laughs> well, you're a pathetic. You're in a pathetic warthog. Of course they died. Mm. 
Okay, so I think we're mostly clear. Oh, there's some units. <clears throat> and there's a wraith. <laughs> uh, I'll take care of the wraith. I'll take care of the wraith. I'm gonna take care of the infantry. Do that one over there. Oh, there's another wraith. Holy shit! Yeah. Yeah, I'll destroy this one. Okay, it's, it's dead. Uh, your your warthog's about to explode. Yeah, but I still got one left. <laughs> yeah, you have the one that matters. <laughs> yes. And Let's... if it explodes, then we're just like almost totally useless. Yep. If it explodes, that just proves that you were unworthy. Ha! I think I'm gonna lose a unit here. Now we just need to survive for 20 minutes and make sure none of the... Or, we don't care about three, everyone. Three yeah. can screw himself because he goes away early and just blows up. Yeah. But we, need to, we need to protect two and one. Yeah, I'm, gonna, I'm about to lose one of my hornets. <laughs> this thing is about to explode. It's the unfortunate part there. Very vulnerable to infantry. Somehow they are surviving. I'm yeah. on my way to help. You know, what, I'm gonna put down a heal unit here. You need it. I need it. Yep. Yeah. Is the rest of you guys? Oh yeah. Just so I we bring it up, the police cars in this lab are totally different than the ones in New Mombasa. Yeah. Which of course makes sense because. It's 2531, not 2552, and it's a colony, so. Yep. Yeah. And there's okay. also a bunch of other vehicles, like, where, where is it, where is it, where is it? Oh, there's, like, a bunch of vehicles at the back over here that yeah. are, like, totally unique, and some look uh, actually pretty cool, like ambulances and all that. Yeah. Oh, wow, there's actually the bus thing from ODST in this. Oh, wow. Oh, you mean the Oliphant? No, the Oliphant, I'm actually meaning the, the actual buses. Huh, that's cool. <clears throat> Cargo 3's got nobody, so at least when, the, when they go out, they're not going to kill anybody, take anybody with them. Yeah. And there goes one of my hornets. Oh, but hey, speaking of Cargo 3. Yeah. I actually remember, like, the first time I ever played through this game, I thought that, oh, there's got to be a way to actually save it. <laughs> that would be kind of cool if there was. But nope, he just dies. Sadly. I Oh my god, this hornet is like... <laughs> it's like Kirito in that one up in, in Sword Art Online. He's got that one smidge of health. In case anybody was ever wondering if that's a bull, if that's bullshit. Okay, do you want to do you want to claim the one up uh over over in the east and I'll claim the or I'll claim the one. Oh, wait, oh, wait. Why, oh, why am I going to Okay, I was about to go over there. Oops. Okay, yeah, I'll just do that. Oh, yeah, our supplies are going up slowly now. Yep. Da -da -da. Okay. Totally love the architecture on this level. Oh, yeah. Like the fountain right here. Like, wow. Yeah, it's there's there was a lot of thought that went into the design of Arcadia. The Spartans is uh, getting his ass is uh, about to die. We're here to save as many civilians as we can, oh, but there's no way we I can save them caught all. There. Okay, supply pad, reactor, and barracks. Oh. No barracks. But, okay, we've already established the second base game. We we know. Okay. So you're building two uh, two supply pads, right? Three supply pods. Okay, next one I'll build a barracks over at the uh, at the western base. Yeah, okay, well, in fact, I'll just destroy one of them and then... No, 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 don't worry, we're almost... Okay. <sighs> now you can rebuild it. <laughs> Ooh, 
It'd be cool if you could actually get these. I don't know. Can you? So, oh, yeah. Should we save Adam now? Oh, no. We'll wait until our, we've got a few Marines and then we'll start saving yeah. Adam. So we actually Adam. Have some forces. Yeah. Adam, though, kind of like just is there. He's like totally. I don't know what to call him. He's just there. Yep. Wait, where the hell? Why didn't it build? That was weird. Like for some reason, it didn't build my bar. It didn't build the barracks, even though I selected it. I know the footage will show I selected it. Station upgrade complete. Sometimes the game does that, though. It's it's weird. Yeah. Okay. Let's get you up because this firebase is the one that's really going to come under attack. Yeah. Oh, hey, this, we uh, and we want this one to come under attack, because if this one becomes under attack, then we can just yeah. let it stay. And then it stops any enemy forces going towards the civilians, yep. which I don't actually care about. <laughs> I mean, does, oh, that, does oh, anyone really actually, care? No. Oh, wow, there's actually bins in this game. Oh, my there's, God. There's what? Bins. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All the details in this game, and I noticed the bins. I'm, I, I swear to God, dude, look at my Hornets. This one is still just, like, he's hanging on by a thread. It's actually kind, it's actually kind of, like, I, I'm rooting for him. It's like, last, last. Should we just put a heel over there, or should we just let him do his thing? I, I, I don't know. I'm not sure. I, I don't want to wait, because I don't want to waste the... Uh, I don't want to waste the supply, the resources. Enemy engagement. But at the same time, I want him to live because he's he's held out for so long. Put him oh. in a corner. Oh, put him next. Oh, put... Is he gone? No, he's still there. Base under attack. You should move him to the back corner of the map somewhere and then just leave him there. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, go go Spartan. He just hijacked Spartan just hijacked a Wraith. That's cool. Okay, there they are. Look at that. <laughs> They're all here now. Why didn't you build? We can't take much more of this. Get them off us. Okay. Oh yeah, we should. We need to start making units now, don't we? Yeah, that's probably a good idea. We have a good number of supplies, so go ahead and uh, start pumping out some units. Oh yeah, I also, we also need to like put new blood as well so that they actually live a little bit longer. Oh yeah, um, I'll research that. You can keep building uh, units. So, so I just built a couple unit, just a couple units to have over here. I'll let you take care of main units, and I'm researching new blood too. So, um, new blood guys. Yep, <laughs> everyone likes their new blood. I actually wonder if it's actually a direct reference to that. Because that'd be insane. It could, it could be. That'd be kind of cool. Won't deny. Once we, once all our units have like, okay, we're, they're, it's being attacked. Okay, come on, units, you can now defend the space. Okay, let, let's now nah, let's use a heal and repair. Oh, there's two of them. Oh, yay. We somehow glitched the game. <laughs> that healed um, up really fast. Over here. That, yeah, that oh, oh my god. Holy shit. Yeah, they're not kidding. Let's, uh, let's see if I can get my, my one hornet in on that action before it fades. Yeah, holy shit. That is really going up quick. <laughs> I'm, like, really surprised. I don't think that was meant to happen, though. I don't care. It's it, it, I'm not quite, I'm not gonna look that gift horse in the mouth. All right. Do, 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 do. Uh, what else can we talk about? Um, oh yeah, there was that like timeline issue thing that you mentioned earlier on oh yes i completely forgot to bring it up yeah so 
it's an interesting little uh, timeline issue that CNA, CIA unintentionally, po- oh, I guess intentionally pointed out. Um, I was trying to say something else, but I don't know what. But regardless, so in the Halo Wars Prima, Prima Guide, um, they say that the Covenant discovered uh, the S.H.I.E.L.D. world like some years. I don't know if they give a specific amount of time, but you know, some years before. Yeah, just years. It's, they they yeah. don't say any time at all. They just yeah. say, we discovered they, this years ago. Um, but they could never get it activated. But yes. And the Halo, like the an old uh, ha- like the Halo One Hundred One timeline or whatever thing, whatever it is, <laughs> um, they say that they discovered it because of Arcadia, like the ruins on Arcadia that you're fighting on, which to me personally makes a lot more sense. Because otherwise, why have our like at least from a, um, a narrative's perspective, why have Arcadia in here at all? If not, if it, and like those ruins, if they weren't supposed to lead to. Uh, the shield world. And actually, as CIA pointed out to me, it's like, it doesn't, like, why would Arcadia point to there? What's the significance? But, you know, from a narrative perspective, it just makes more sense. So it's a little, it's a it's a small conundrum. And that banshee just crashed right into those hunters. <laughs> oh, wow. It, it got shot down by my marines, and it just, like, crashed right into the hunters. It didn't, I don't think it did any damage, but it was just funny to see. This is a moment where I can't wait to see the actual footage on his end. Oh yeah. There's uh there's some awesome stuff going on. Oh yeah, what's our, what going. is our what is our kill count on elites right now? I have no idea. I'll tie in a second. I haven't been keeping track of it. Forte, we just need to kill ten more. Okay. Cause yeah, I wanna get definitely wanna get the uh <clears throat> We got plenty incoming over by this other our our other base. So, <laughs> yeah. God damn, we got a lot of resources, don't we? Yeah, Excellent. we just need to like, we just need to like to start building up stuff now and just making sure units don't die. Yeah. Like and I, there I goes made, all the resources. <laughs> I think we've got like an, well, I'm just like I've researched ten marines over here, so I think we're just gonna like spitting out marines, and I'm just gonna like. Sp- throw them all against the enemy base for some weird reason. <laughs> yeah. Just because I know, or just because I know we're going to live, which we, like, is there, is this thing getting destroyed? Nope, that's going to live. Is this getting destroyed? No, that's going to live. Mm. We're doing oh, really well, guys. There's a, uh, there's a thing over here that doesn't have any Marines. I don't know if you want to do anything with that. Nah, that'll be fine. Oh, wait, we need to save Adam, don't we? I oh, yes, forgot. we do. We do. Let's let's uh, do it now. Wait, we need to make sure that the route is clear first before we save them directly. Yeah. Like, okay. make sure all hunters are dead. Like, anywhere around here. He goes to Cargo 2, right? Yeah, but so okay. if Cargo 2 is destroyed, then he goes to Cargo 1. Okay, so, so I'll take care of these hunters quickly. And very rarely, if Cargo 3 is alive and you activate it, but this happens very rarely, I've only had it once. Yeah. Ah, we'll just go to Cargo 3 and then just die with the rest of them. <laughs> don't worry, it still counts towards the achievement. Okay, Cargo yeah. 1's getting really hit. I don't know if you can spare any units over there. Cargo 1 here. We can't take much more of this. Get them off us. Yeah, I'm just going to send all the Marines there right now just because... Okay, I'm going to keep my Hornets over here and I'll keep, uh, I'll keep Adam alive. Here we go. Oh yeah, we can... Oh yeah, I forgot. We can actually... I forgot we actually have to do the RPG ability because that really helps. Oh yes. Now the, is Adam spa- yeah, Adam's out, so I'm escorting him. Uh, do you want to save Cargo One? Because it sounds like they're getting hit really hard. It's it's dead. Oh okay. 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 So it doesn't all, to car- all to Cargo Two, everyone. Yep. No, it must have gotten hit by the mega turret. Yeah. Okay, I'm just gonna put, uh. Not yeah. there. Yeah, definitely. Good idea. Ah, <laughs> uh, go Spartan. <laughs> decide, you decide, Jacked. Okay. I, I, what? Oh my, I just love this bridge of Marines. <laughs> Alright. I'll leave Adam with you. I'm gonna go take care of some other enemies so we can try and get that. He wears a baseball cap. Wow. Really? Yeah, he wears a baseball cap. A red one. Base 
They're just looking closely at it, really. <laughs> and the skull just appeared. Alright, you go and get it. I'll go grab, grab it because I'm pretty close. <clears throat> also, so I can have it on screen. <laughs> Alright. What I'm going to do now is just take some of these units. And both there it is, one. the skull. Let's grab just... that. Woo woo. Oh, woo. Yep. <laughs> love woo. Which, of course, turns the scarab beams into rainbows of love. <laughs> uh, made of pure love. Yep. And the skull also has a kiss on it. Oh, uh, yes, I forgot about that. <laughs> Woo. So I get we did save Adam, though, right? Yeah, we saved Adam. Okay. And one of our Spartans is down. Or one of these Spartans is down. I will okay, save uh, you. Uh, All right. Even though it's like totally useless to save him now. I don't really because... care. I don't really care. I'm going to save him anyway. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> How funny would it be if they could actually hijack like a spirit or something like that? <laughs> or a dropship. Oh, that would God. be insane. Yes, it would. Okay. Granted, the spirits only appear in, whatchamacallit, in campaign. Yeah. But that would be that would just be cool. Oh, all the marines, all the civilians are just getting stuck. Oh my god! Because <laughs> of all the marines. Yes. Oh god, you might want to spread them out just a bit then. All right. Just look at them; they're all just standing there. Okay, now they're moving now. Yep. Oh, we got hunters. Hunters in the courtyard. There we go. Woo! Look at all that blood. Now it's gone. I think it's safe to say, guys, that we've done this now. Don't jinx it. <laughs> okay, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to... Wait, do I have many units here, or are they all just dying? Uh, we're a few units short of a full stack, but... Now we have them all. Okay, so how is Car Cargo 2 is luckily doing very well right now, so... Yeah, and we're just, uh, I'm just like, sending a bunch of units this way. Okay. All units. Target acquired. Then goes right about here, so yeah. Holy shit, there's the base. <laughs> Oh, no Megatur for some strange reason. Oh, wow. Yeah. Oh, God. Get away, get away, get away, my units. My lovely units. Oh, boy. We're not going to destroy this thing. <laughs> no, we're not. No, we, uh, we did not manage this for that purpose. <laughs> oh, God. Ooh, there it goes. But on the bright side, we'll actually win. So. Oh, there's a hunter gold. Oh yeah, I, lo I always love that the uh, the uh, it disappeared. But yeah, the classic Paragoc design, I guess, would be the way to describe it. You are getting killed so bad. But we have ODSC, so there you go. <laughs> Hot drop right in. Well, that actually destroyed it. Oh my god. I mean, <laughs> here I'll put I'll do a little uh, how about this little uh, aid. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Might want to get some more ODSTs in there. Yep, there you go. <laughs> Resupply. Well, we to end an episode. It's something I yeah. <laughs> hardly ever done. 
I normally do it on my nor this sort of thing on my normal playthrough, but usually I have like a shit ton of tanks. <laughs> We've this done it. Been, yep. This has been this is a very oh like I can't believe we did that with just ground forces. <laughs> with just infantry and a few and a few pellet a few uh, hornets, which oh my god, they're all I can't believe they're all alive. Okay. Woo! That this is was, totally uh, non canon way stuff happens. Yes. <laughs> oh, God. The UNSC forces do not win this situation, situation, guys. Hey, look at that, an optional base. Yes. Totally the canon way stuff happens. The UNSC hold their own and just save the city. Yeah. Wait, does that like totally wipe out the entire enemy forces almost? More or less, but I mean, they're, they're still spawning in over here. I shouldn't take long just to kill them now. Yep. <laughs> now just. We're so close. We can do it. Yes, we can do it. Yay. And there goes my phone. It <laughs> 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 uh, could be anything from a Facebook message to a tweet. to That's probably Twitter, though. Yay. Yes. Oh, we got it. We did it. Totally. Finally, it only took it. It only took two goddamn hours <laughs> in total. Transports are away. We totally did not save the city, guys. We totally did not. Nope. The enemy base is still there. <laughs> Canonically. Oh, it goes. Oh man. Okay. Well, go us. Well, that was that was a lot of fun. That was a lot of, a lot of things. Oh, but I'm so glad it's done. Um, you definitely don't see that we we're on easy difficulty, not at all. Nope, that was totally not easy. That was actually legendary. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Believe it or not, no. Um, but okay, so yeah, that was fun though. Um, we got a got a lot done. We got a li we got some really good discussion. I like to think. I hope you guys found it entertaining. And yep. I might have a blooper reel. We'll see. <laughs> the first of hopefully many. <laughs> That's uh, about two hours of footage to go through, so. Woo. Yep. But that all aside, thank you, CIA, for joining me because I had a lot of fun talking with you, playing with you, and an episode that was actually where the, foot the game actually ran smoothly for once. <laughs> yep. Hopefully, you all enjoy it, folks, because this was great. Indeed. Two hours yeah. of greatness. <laughs> yeah, how, how terrible would it be if I actually posted all two hours unedited? To be but honest, no. I think your fans would love it. I they might, they really might, but I'm not going to do that. I'll I'll <laughs> I'll select some key moments and uh, I'll do like a blo I might do a blooper reel like for next week or something because at this point I got to go write some scripts. <laughs> Because I am, I I owe my I owe my subscribers a Fall of Reach review, and I tend I intend to deliver. So, thank is you. Is that all the out animation there. one, or is that the... no, no, no? I already did that. I'm the oh player. yeah, <laughs> the good one. Yeah, the good one. Yeah. So, thank you all out there for watching. Thank you again, CIA, for joining me here. My um, pleasure. Yep. Can't wait yeah, to watch this also play. Yeah, there were definitely some interesting moments. And uh, until next time, guys, this has been Halo Cannon. Thanks for watching. Be sure to give a like and consider subscribing and sharing this video around. Also consider checking out Gamefly with over 8,000 new releases and classic games for current and previous gen consoles and even some older consoles. Gamefly is a great way to try tons of games without buying them. Go to GameflyOffer.com slash Halo Cannon to start your 30-day free trial.